If you want to know which restaurants offer magical cast member discounts close to Disney housing, check out this video. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Christina and I'm a former and a future Disney cast member. I'm about to start my second culture representative program for Germany at Epcot at the end of 2000, no, at the end of January 2019. So as I'm getting ready for my latest adventure, I can't help but get super excited about all the incredible food I'm about to be uh, around again, not only at Disney, but also close around Disney housing. So if you are about to move to the US for the very first time, get ready for a lot of great food. I know many people have heard different things about um, American food and their portion size and all of that, but nevertheless, there's so, so many great things to try out. So. I created this little list with restaurants close to Disney housing that offer great Disney cast member discounts that I want you to make sure to check out. So here they are in no particular order. Let's start. So the first one, you probably will hear anybody telling you, especially if you close, uh, live close to Vista or at Vista is Wendy's. So Wendy's is right around the corner from Vista Way. It is a chain that is mostly offering fast food hamburgers, fries, and anything that comes with that. So their discount for Disney cast members is if you show your blue ID, you get a Frosty for free. You can choose between a vanilla and chocolate, and it's pretty nice. Um, it's a, like a thicker kind of milkshake, like a mix between ice cream and milkshake. It's nice, tried with fries. Hey, I'm not judging. Might have done that myself. Pretty cool, check it out. Next one is Golden Corral. Now Golden Corral is close to Vista. You still need to walk a couple of minutes. I don't think more than 10 minutes and you get there. It's a buffet restaurant. It's like an all American chain. You pay up front, you get a cup, you um, look for a table. You will have a waiter that will take care of the dirty dishes and also uh, will take care of refilling your cup. Other than that, it's a buffet, so you serve yourself. And the thing about Golden Corral is the buffet is humongous. It is humongous and has everything from A to Z basically and they also have a soup and salad buffet like a station they also have a humongous dessert station and their food is um the price is very inexpensive you're probably looking at like ten dollars per person for an all-you-can-eat buffet um, i think that already includes a 10 percent discount for disney cast members so make sure to mention that up front and show your blue id the buffet has everything from pasta pizza they have different kind of meats they have fish they have salads they have vegetables of course they have all kinds of um, interesting american dishes so what I uh, would highly recommend why to try out Golden Corral at least once is uh, go there just to get like an idea of the American food. I know it's, it sounds kind of weird, but um, if it's your first time in the US and there are so many dishes that you might have heard from like your favorite American TV show and never had it before um, because they don't have it in your home country, most likely Golden Corral will have it. So they have things like um, pies, like pecan pie, um, pumpkin pie. They have like sweet potato casserole or like um, souffle with marshmallows on top. So that's those are dishes and things that you've heard on TV, I've seen on TV, but most likely you never tried them in your home country. So that's something I love, love about Golden Corral, going there and trying out all the typical somewhat American dishes and just to get an idea and finally get to try them. If you don't like them, just grab a little uh, piece of it, try it, and that's it. If you love them, go and get some more. That's the beauty of the buffet, but make sure to give it at least a try. Next one is BJ's. 
Okay, I will be honest, I've not been to BJ's. It's a table service restaurant, um, a steakhouse restaurant, I believe uh, that's what they are. And they were super popular with the people from the UK pavilion back at my program, because first, they are open super late. So if you work a very late shift um, at Epcot, most UK people got an Uber and then just <laughs> two or three ubers at once just go to bj's they had um apparently they have great food for a good price they also have a humongous variety of uh, drinks especially beers a lot of international beers also on tap or craft beer on tap so that's always a good um, reason to go to a place like that Apparently they have a 10% discount for Disney cast members, so make sure to show your Google ID to your um, waiter. Also, rumor has it, the pizza cookie is apparently a legend, so it's a dessert. I will make sure to try it out, grab an Uber uh, after my shift at Epcot and go over there for some great food, beers and a pizza cookie, I guess. Next one. Once again, close to Vista, I'm sorry, but Vista is surrounded by all the restaurants. Nevertheless, there are a few that are close to comments, but I'll get into that later. Next one is Cece's Pizza. Now, Cece's Pizza has a killer, killer, killer discount for cast members. Cece's Pizza is a pizza buffet, but they also have things like salads and uh, pasta and a bit of desserts, I believe, as well. So um, they offer a discount, so you have to only pay $2.99 as a cast member. That is very cheap. I cannot tell you about the quality of the food because I honestly have not been to CeCe's Pizza close to Vista, but I've been to CeCe's Pizza um, elsewhere in Florida before, a couple of years ago. And I remember they having decent pizza, at least for that price, um, interesting pizza. And what I remember was the yummy one is um, the apple pie pizza. So again, desserts. I have a sweet tooth, so there is that. Um, that one was really nice. So uh, it's not far away walking distance from Vista. It's uh, right next to that Dollar Tree I've mentioned a couple of times before and not far away from the Starbucks. So if it's Wednesday and you're broke and um, the paycheck is about to hit your bank account on Thursday and you're sick and tired of ramen noodles or a cup of noodles, might want to give Cece's Pizza a try. Next one for all my commons people out there is the food court in the outlet mall. So the outlet mall across from commons and you people from Patterson and Chatham can walk there as well. Um, if you walk across to the commons outlet mall over there, the food court has um, most of the stands there have also cast member discounts and they have a variety of stands. Um, so Asian food, pizza, Mexican food, I believe. They also have salads and smoothies. Basically, it's an all-American food court that you will find in the mall. Most of them offer a 10% discount for cast members. So if you are not in, in the mood um, to cook, walk over there, look around, and then get a discount with your meal. Next great place with a great discount is Bahama Breeze. Bahama Breeze is in the same parking lot as Golden Corral, so it's gonna be about 10 minutes walk from Vista. Bahama Breeze is a full table service uh, restaurant, so you will be expected to pay a, a tip, but obviously you will have a waiter who will be taking care of you. So Bahama Breeze has a great food. They have like an tropical Bahamas influenced uh, kitchen and meals there. I've been there a couple of times. They had incredible lunch. I love their lunch menu. They had fish tacos, which were incredible. And um, I loved, loved their just basic plain um, salad that I got with my meal. The dressing was incredible. I fell in love with it. It's really nice. It's good food for a good price. And they offer from 11 to 
4 p.m. from Monday to Friday, a 25% discount for cast members. So take that plus take the lunch menu, you get a really great deal on really good food and really great service. So make sure to check out Bahama Breeze. So my all time favorite and probably the place that you are most likely to run into me is sweet tomatoes. I love sweet tomatoes. It's incredible. I've been there many, many times. I've taken every single family member I know that came and visit to sweet tomatoes. Everybody loved it. Everybody loved it. It is in Crossroads. Um, we're in that area where all of those um, great restaurants are and not far away from Vista. You can Uber there if um, it's a bit of a walk. Uh, you can either Uber there, uh, live there or walk there. It's up to you. But it's again a buffet. Pretty popular in the US, all those buffets. But um, this buffet is really incredible when it comes to great, healthy, wholesome and delicious food. It's incredible. So when you enter, there's first this really long salad bar with already pre-prepared salads that are really like, nice, like walnut, blue cheese, spinach ones. Or you can um, create your own salad as you walk up to the register, then you pay, you show your blue ID, you grab also a cup to drink, you will be in charge of refilling your own cups. So behind the register, wonderful buffet is awaiting you. And what I like about uh, sweet tomatoes the most, every time I've been there, it was very clean, the prices were good, the quality of the food food was amazing, the people, the employees were very nice and uh, what I personally love about sweet tomatoes, they have very nice variety, very creative dishes, they have a soup buffet and um, they have signs that tell you what it is but not only that but also they're very good when it comes to being allergic like have uh, being gluten intolerant or lactose intolerant, they put um, put clearly on a sign if it's vegetarian or if it's vegan and I just love that is really customer friendly especially if you have like an allergy or something like that or you're a picky eater and um, they have also dessert bar they also have like a pizza and pasta station or something it's all everything in, in like small sizes but that's the beauty of it you can try as many as you want and or leave it behind if you don't like it they have a place where you can create your own loaded potato again great quality fresh food incredible 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 i can wait to go back to sweet tomatoes now here's a one like a bonus a restaurant I guess it's not close to Disney housing somewhat close you really need to take an uber or lift there or have an American friend with a car or maybe buy a car yourself but anyways it's worth it it's my all-time favorite all-time favorite it's Panda Express it's incredible it's Chinese Asian Chinese food and it's really nice it's um incredibly it's tasty it's fresh because you can see how they prepare everything behind the counter and what i like even past the area where they cook there is this fridge and you can see all of the ingredients like all of the veggies and those clear containers and you can see them and you can see how fresh they are and then they're being put in um, the dish and then it's served up front and you tell as you walk down the counter um, the employee what you would like to have on your plate and then you play, um, pay towards the end they have a 10% discount and I cannot wait to go back to Panda Express and have those chow mein with honey walnut trims uh, incredible I love it so you might think this was a long list Oh no, there are so many more restaurants right around the corner from this tower in that whole area. It's impossible to mention them all without this being like a three hour video. So these were just a handful of great ones that I know that offer great Disney discounts. But honestly, no matter where you go in the Orlando area, especially close to Disney housing, always have your blue ID on you. Always um, ask kindly and friendly. 
um, for a cast member discount. You will be surprised how many places have cast member discounts and many of them have some that are even greater than 10%, but still 10% are great as well. So make sure to always ask for nicely for a discount. The worst thing that can happen, they will say no and you pay full price, but you were willing on paying that anyway, uh, anyway somewhere else. So there's no, no harm done. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys checking out this video. If you're a former cast member, let me know down in the comments below which place did you love to go out and eat? What was your favorite dish and which great discounts they had? Also, if you're a new cast member or about to become one, just like I am, let me know what you guys are most excited about trying except Panda Express because I know I got everybody now excited for Panda. But let me know down in the comments below what you guys are um, excited about trying. Also make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so you will never miss an episode a video here on Thursday. Also come and join me and follow me on Instagram because I will have a more personal and up close experience waiting for you guys there. Come with me on my journey of becoming a cast member once again and throughout my whole program I uh, will be happy to have you along with me on my great adventure. Thank you guys so much once again for watching and I'll see you in my next video on Thursday. Bye bye.